Hey, Dylan. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good, good. good. Give me an update, how are you feeling today? I'm um, pretty good. Um, actually, doing all right. I've been traveling, so, mm -hmm. um, you know, I was expecting to be a little more sore, but actually doing pretty good. Just a little stiffness in the lower back, and that's it. All right. Yeah, so I did well. That's awesome, good to hear. So, all right, let's tune you up. We'll go face down. Face down? Yep. See what's happening in Galen's spine today. Where'd you travel to? Um, I was in Phoenix for some volunteer work stuff, and then um, I was in Texas visiting my family. Okay, cool. How was Phoenix? Was it hot? Yeah, actually, it was weird. They were having all those monsoons. Okay. So it was raining the whole time. Oh, cool. So it wasn't that bad. Yeah, that's good. That keeps it keeps the temperature down. Keeps it down to a hundred at least. <laughs> yeah, in the nineties. <laughs> but Texas was really hot and humid. They lived down on the coast. Mm -hmm. I must have cool. sweated off at least ten pounds. Oh, good for you. It's a good way to get rid of it. So. Cool. Yeah, I was doing some outside work for them in their yard, mm -hmm. and you know I had to finish by noon because I was just drenched in sweat. Mm -hmm. It got so hot, I was like, okay, I'm not used to this. Mm -hmm. It's okay when I grew up there, but <laughs> not anymore. How close are they to the ocean? Huh? How close are they, they to the uh, ocean? Actually, they're about, from your house to the beach, it's really only about 15 minutes. Beautiful. They're on the coast right below Galveston Island. Okay. Is it nice? I know. The Texas beaches, they're not. That part of Texas, they get a lot of the silt from the Mississippi River. Okay. So the beaches are more brown, and the water is always stirred up. It's, you know, it's not really very clear there, and you can't see, like, once you get in the water, you can't see your feet or anything. Okay. So it's not like Florida Panhandle beaches mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. some of the Caribbean beaches. You know, it's nothing like that. Well, you went to visit family anyway, not to sit on the beach. Yeah, yeah. But I'm not a big beach fan anymore. Why not? I mean, growing up there, I prefer, you know, going to the lakes or, you know, just to hang out by a pool or a lake than I would on the beach. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I, you know, I had my house in Rehoboth, so obviously I kept going, but... Um, how are your parents doing? They're yeah, fine. I mean, you know, still things, kicking. Huh? Still kicking. Yeah. All things considered, they're doing pretty good. How old are they? Dad's 83 and mom's 77. Hmm. Are they enjoying their old age? Um, yes and no. I mean, I think like most elderly folks. Um, once they start having health issues, you know, it kind of slows them down. And, you know, my mom has a lot of um, arthritis. Mm -hmm. And so that gets, you know, quite painful at times. Mm -hmm. And the humidity doesn't help. Mm -hmm. yeah. But, you know, for the most part, they're doing okay. Good. All right, let's do a couple pushes here. Good to hear. We'll start with this guy here. Okay, deep breath in through your nose. Out. Good shoulders. Oh, yeah. That's really nice. Okay, one at the top, another breath in. And out. That's good. Let it go. Good. Deep breath in. And out. Shoulders relax. Good. All right, one more at the bottom now. Deep breath in, far as you can go. Good. And out. Let it go.
right? Let's do this. Lay on your left side, right side up. How's the book coming? Um, getting close. I just finished mm -hmm. sketching out the climax scene. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that's the mm -hmm. part that's going to be fit, so. Mm -hmm. You said it was like complicated and a lot was happening and so like getting it on paper was the challenge, right? Yeah, or just trying to figure out, you know, it's a climax. It needs to be, in, you know. Climactic. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly. So, I'm trying to make it not boring. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. All right, deep breath in and out. Bring the hip down. Good. Shoulders relax. Good. Sinking. Now let it all drop in. Good. Hold on one more. Let's bring the hip just a little bit further. Better. On your back. What's the title of your book going to be? Do you know? Um, Wildflower Bomb. Wildflower Bomb. Coming soon to a bookstore near you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, deep breath in. Good. And out. Good. We're bring the hip down. Good. Shoulders sinking. Hips sinking. Good. On your back. Mm -hmm. Any teeth grinding recently? Um, I don't know if there's teeth grinding, but definitely clenched, clenched mm -hmm. jaws. Mm -hmm. That'd be a good climax. You just have a clenched huh? jaw. That, that would be a good climax. <laughs> a clenched jaw, and then all the teeth explode. <laughs> Makes me think of a Gilligan's Island episode. Really? Yeah. You ever saw that? Yeah, absolutely. Go ahead. What was the they, episode? They um, had explosive plastics on the island, and they put a professor filled some of his feelings with the explosive plastic. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> and so he was afraid he was going to explode. I felt like they were set on that island. I don't know why they were always trying to get off of it. It seemed like they had it going. Hey, they all I, had a place to live. Yeah, when I was a kid, that was my big dream, was to get stranded on Gilligan's Island. <laughs> I love with that them. Show. I love you that need show. You to be there with them, though. <laughs> yeah, no, I love that show. I thought mm -hmm. it was... I used to come home from school and watch them on the reruns, you know? Mm -hmm. I, you know what? I was listening to, like, a modern-day mainstream hip-hop song and it was straight it was a straight rap song mm -hmm. and the rapper referred to thurston howell <laughs> and i was hanging out with some like early 20 year olds and, yeah. I, and they knew and i was like how do you all know about thurston howell <laughs> some of them did not mm -hmm. that's funny yeah that was, that was hilarious do you know what song that is josh we'll have to figure it out let us know in the comments section all right let's get your neck adjusted here all right, nice and gentle. We're to the right side first. Good, bring us over to the side. Good, that's very good, Ian. Nice and gentle, a little sinking. Good. Good. Yeah, yeah let's do. Switch. Yeah. So this is a, this this is it right here. So I, you're just opposite side of me, and then good. We're gonna do the left side here, sinking. Good. Good. <laughs> These are the serious socks. Let it sink in. Good. Good, let it go. One more. That's right there. Let this relax. Good, let it go. How's it knee? Uh, doing pretty good. Actually, I'm, I, when I was out in Texas, I was running the whole time. Oh, really? Put in you know, at least um, probably 25 miles that week. Just cool. running, so it's and it felt fine. Good at the time, so 
Good. All right, bend your knees. And uh, let's just, yeah, uh -huh. we'll just do a little tap. Uh -huh. Good. We're actually a year out. It was 820, August 20th last year. That was the oh, first time you came in here. Okay. And hey, so, can... and when was your surgery? I'm in October. October. Yeah. So that's 10. So I came 20. in right before I did the right. tip toward the meniscus. Yeah. Right. Yeah, and I've been going to CrossFit for about um, two months now. Okay, I'm good. still so. modifying you know, some things, you know, which I you know, will probably keep doing. But like um, other stuff, I'm pretty much been able to do. And I've done like several exercises, so I've been able to, and I'm still hitting even um, like for strength wise, I'm hitting about 80% of my one rep maxes. Cool. So I was pleased with, you know, I hadn't lost as much strength as I thought. Mm -hmm. You know, you're good with that 80% on the one rep max. You don't need to go crazy. Yeah, no, I probably will. Yeah, I mean, that's one of the things I probably am. My days of hitting new one rep max are probably over. <laughs> good, 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 good. Now it's just kind of keeping them in the sort of range. Exactly. Did your partner go down to Texas with you? Huh? Did your partner go down to Texas with you? Uh, he um yeah he does some sort of he does kind of his own routine. Mm -hmm. Down that, there, but he went down, but then did his own thing. Huh? He went down, but then did his own thing, or does his own routine. Well, I mean, he does he runs with me sometimes, mm -hmm. but like a lot of times he ha he does a lot of yoga and some other stuff too. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. so he's not he can't he like three miles is about all he wants mm -hmm. to run. Yeah. See, I, I, does yoga, doesn't want to run a lot. That's why I've never met the man. <laughs> He's keeping himself out of my office. <laughs> Probably true. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's do a sit up here. Swing your legs off to the window. Yep, uh-huh. All right, let's do this. Bring your chin down to your chest. Go okay, just like this. We're going to reach around here. Yeah, okay, let's do this one first here. I'm going to bring this one up. Go let this one relax here. Good. Good. You got a deadline for your book? Do what? Do you have a deadline for your book? Do you have a deadline? Oh, yeah. Um, I was wanting to finish uh, the complete writing by the end of September. Mm -hmm. And then I need to take two months off before I start re doing the revisions. It's a long way ahead. Yeah, yeah. It always is. It's always a process. Mm -hmm. It's okay. We're just building anticipation for it now. <laughs> yeah, that two months off is critical, though. You really get to decompress, like, being submersed in it for that long. Yeah. And it gives you a fresh set of eyes. Yeah. And I, hopefully it's, mm -hmm. when I go back to it, I still like it. <laughs> That's the challenge. Mm -hmm. I hear you. It really is. There's a lot of things that I've written and recorded, and I go back and I'm like, this is garbage. <laughs> they seem much better when I was writing them. <laughs> What's that? I said, yeah, and you get that. They seem much better when I was writing them. <laughs> yeah. All right, so anything else you want to work on, look at today? No. All right, man. Good. good to meet you. All right. Good seeing you. Glad Thank you had you. a good trip. You're welcome. Thanks for your effort and playing along today. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Check out Galen's book coming 2022. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man. I'll see you next time. <laughs>